Broncos pick is in. Who they have. got? Uh, wide receiver Jerry Judy. Ooh. Okay, Jerry Judy. Judy. It was intriguing that Henry Ruggs was drafted over Jerry Judy with how Jerry Judy was their number one target at Alabama. So either the Raiders think that Saban and Tua and everybody at Alabama are stupid, or they think that they found something <laughs> in him. Jerry Judy was a hell of a player. I thought for sure he was going to be the number one wide receiver off the board. But now the Denver Broncos with Drew Locke at the helm have found another weapon. This guy's a stud, and I think he's going to transition very well into the NFL. Oh, I think he's going to be a monster, especially coming from Alabama, playing against top flight competition for the majority of the year. Not those out of conference games that Nick Saban likes to, mm. people like to, to kill him for. But you know what? He's still playing against some studs and game pretty much every single week. But I, I love him, man. I think he's really good. <laughs> I just got your text message. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you about that later, actually. Oh, is that right? Usually off air conversations just make their way on there. With you. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it was just something regarding the show that we had yeah. to get situated. Yeah, of course. Uh, John Elway. Technical. John Elway, that man right there. This one's for Pat. Thank you, John. Uh, I appreciate you doing that for me. His dive into the end zone, getting twisted around, yeah. is a legendary play. Him at quarterback is legendary. Him giving the keys over to Peyton Manning and just kind of letting them do their thing, awesome. But since then, you're 100% right. They have not really hit at the quarterback position. A lot of people say that John Elway doesn't want them to hit on a quarterback because he doesn't want his name to potentially go down <laughs> in the record books as quarterbacks for the Denver Broncos. Though. But I think Drew Locke's a guy. Jerry Judy could be good. And their fans, three of them didn't show up. They've been blocked from the game. If you get blocked from the Zoom behind uh -oh. Goodell, is that because you were saying expletives during the break or something oh, like that? Yeah. Goodell's like, get him the fuck out of there. <laughs> Block him as well. Okay, here we go. Congratulations, Jerry Judy. Got a family out there. What are those big things on the table there? Little Voss? Is that a Voss? I don't know. They're fancy. They are very fancy. Hmm table weight it's a centerpiece he's from deerfield beach florida he received straight a <laughs> senior year of high school not wow. easy to do dedicated football career to his sister Aaliyah. Aaliyah passed away jerry's senior year of high school okay so this guy has been through some things this guy got straight a's the same year his sister passed away this is a mentally tough guy and in alabama had a hell of a career this feels like a guy by the way that gruden would have taken this feels like a, a, a guy who is who, who would have fit in with the Raiders, but instead now the Broncos take him. Maybe he'll be able to light up that division that seems to be kind of following a little bit. I know that I'm joking. They got the Chiefs there. That's that's a tough division. That is a tough, tough division. So are you trying to say when, when you, you said that people claim that maybe John Elway doesn't want a quarterback coming in there and erasing his records, are you saying if a guy like Pat Mahomes was available, he wouldn't go after him? Well, Pat Mahomes was available for the Broncos, and they did not take him. But they, at the time, though, you didn't know he was going to become the Pat Mahomes that he is in the NFL. I think if you look at my mock draft, I did know that. Mm -hmm. I mean, don't let this year's mock draft affect how my previous mock drafts have gone. Uh, I did know that. I like this kid a lot, strictly because his, his, the Pizza Hut right there, that is not just sitting there as a commercial. It looks like that has been tapped into a little bit. I respect that from him. And... Uh, I'm a big fan of this pick for them. 6'1", 193. He's as tall as I am, about 57 pounds lighter than I am. <laughs> Much faster, can jump higher, and is an absolute animal. He, I thought he was the first guy, AJ. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Why was he not the first guy? I don't know. I mean, this is a deep receiving class when, when it comes to this whole draft class. But I think I, no matter who you talk to, they all had different opinions on Ooh. what top flight receiver you were going to show. And also, I love that you played at Alabama for Nick Saban. You can't. Nick Saban's not going to let you coast. Like You are going to be used to being coached hard every single day. So that's why I think these guys come out. They're ready to play day one. Look good, feel good. Feel good, play good. Play good, pay good. Pay good, live good, live good, die good.